Hello, Nikki Potter here. So you want to know what to do to have the best possible results for your ombre slice. The first thing is don't touch your brow hairs. Let them grow for as long as you can. If you can get three or four weeks of growth, that would be perfect. The next thing is the healthier and more hydrated your skin is, the better. So drink plenty of water, lots and lots of water. You want to get on a good skincare regimen. If you don't have a good one, we can help you with that. We have some affordable skincare that's amazing. Um, another thing that I've had some clients do is to come in and get a facial before their ombre slay. You can either do it a week before, a couple weeks before, whenever you want to start getting them. A monthly facial is an amazing thing to do. But I've had some clients the same day get a hydrating facial before their ombre and uh, it's done amazing for their results and for their skin, which help with the results. Um, you also want to make sure to not have like any caffeine, aspirin, um, don't use Retin-A products or anything on or around the area for at least 24 to 48 hours before your appointment. You will also want to make sure to follow your aftercare to the T to get the best results. I'll give you everything you need. You won't have to purchase anything extra. Um, and I'll also give you the instructions that I want you to use. So following that will get you the best results. So let us know if you have any questions or anything. And we look forward to seeing you soon. Thank you for watching.